my last video, I talked about hiking into the beautiful Lake Patterson and how we stretched ourselves athletically to get there. While we were there, we did long day hikes as well, averaging 19,000 steps a day. But this backpacking trip also stretched me spiritually in several ways. Hi, my name is Derek and welcome to my YouTube channel. I call it Stretch Yourself because I'm trying to encourage myself and others to stretch ourselves just a little bit in all aspects of our lives. This weekend, I'll be stretching myself athletically and spiritually. And this is Lake Patterson. I'm going to slow things way down for this video. I'm going to talk about the spiritual benefits of hiking, backpacking, and immersing ourselves into nature. I look at this dirt, this rock and stone, these trees and how they survive harsh elements every year. How the water that I see will evaporate and come right back here in the shape of snow. And nearly everything I look at or touch or step on was here before I was born and will most likely be here after I die. We are primitive beings on a small planet orbiting a tiny star in an average galaxy of 300 billion stars that's surrounded by 100 billion other galaxies. It was only 400 years ago that Copernicus told us we're not the center of the universe. These rocks? They're laughing at me. I'm a blip in their timeline. I will come and go and things will just keep on going and these rocks will continue to exist. Now I know this all sounds sad, and probably defeating, but when I rediscover this perception, I let go. My ego realizes that none of this matters. My worries and concerns wash away. I remember that no one's life is less precious than mine. I feel a new level of empathy and understand the desperate importance of kindness to all. I realize that myself and no one else are right or wrong about politics, religion, or anything else. This newfound freedom is liberating. I let go of it all and just simply be. My job involves sales and consulting. It is fast paced and the amount of my compensation is determined by the amount of my involvement and focus. Whenever I am able to immerse myself in nature and get myself out of cell service, I'm able to disconnect and adjust to a slower and healthier tempo. This is known as ecotherapy. Up until three or four generations ago, all of our ancestors experienced this slower pace. It's embedded in us and that's why we feel out of sync with our deepest selves. While I truly enjoy what I do and am very grateful for the life that I have, this temporary respite in nature is healing and reminds me to slow down and find stillness on a regular basis. I 
get so much out of challenges such as this one. Backpacking six miles uphill with a 45 pound pack. Stretching myself athletically. That White Mountain was incredible. But I really enjoy the surprising benefits more. In this case, stretching myself spiritually. By completely immersing myself in nature, I rediscovered the significance of my insignificance and soaked up a slower pace of life. I really hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed making it. If you did, please like and subscribe. How have you stretched yourself? Please leave a comment below. Thanks so much for watching. Whoa, whoa.